hello everyone welcome to tech bro and thank you each and everyone for watching my videos if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe and today i'm showing how to send emails by using blue prism software first of all i thank, I thank everyone okay if you haven't seen my previous videos how to log into gmail you can watch my previous videos in my channel and now i'm going to show you how to send emails by using blue prism some of them have commented i'm not getting like suppose compose option okay Okay, coming to this I have already created one object name email sending and created this flow of the email okay if you are aware of this you can watch my previous videos just I'm running this okay it has started The process is going on. You can uh, see here the steps are moving. Okay, sign in. And then or okay, I have successfully logged into my email. Here you can see. Okay, I've done up to here. Now I'm going to do how to compose and send a mail through Blue Prism software. Okay, for that, first we have to I'm removing the link, keeping that aside. Okay, click on the application modeler. Okay, I have created previously some elements. I'm removing. I'm removing that. Okay, from now I'm adding a new element and naming it as compose. Okay, then click on the identify button then open the internet explorer click on the alt button it will change the modes okay now it is showing the html mode okay you can see there the html mode okay i click on the control left mouse button okay it, it is showing a pop-up then click on the highlight button then immediately it is showing a pop-up no elements match the supplied query terms okay the html mode is not working for the compose button then again click on the identify button it will show a pop-up already identified oh, click on s then again it will show the various modes then this is html mode now i mean then change that to accessibility mode then go to the compose button then click on control left mouse button then again it is showing a pop-up okay then click on the highlight now it is highlighting the compose button okay now you can see okay and then click on apply okay then go to the blue prism action then take a navigate stage open it and name it as compose then I drag the compose to the element and in the action button select the press then click on ok then link 
the comp navigate stage okay just i'm selecting the point to move the compass okay then again click the application modeler and click on add element now we have to send email to others for that i'm naming it as mail id okay then click on identify go to the internet explorer then okay now we have to spy the two for whom we are, we are sending in the html mode i'm spying the the row then click click on control left mouse button okay then it is showing a pop up here click on highlight now it is highlighting the entire row okay then click on apply then okay then again go to the flow chart drag the right button for mail id we have to write for that i am selecting the right stage when you select the right stage you have to select the data item too in the data item i am naming it as mail name okay i am giving the text as a data type in the initial value i am writing my friend's email to whom i am sending the mail okay then click on okay after creating a data item i open the right i'm giving the name as mail name to then click on the text button mail name drag the mail name to the value that's what i created for the data type then drag the element the mail id to the element then click on okay then open the application modeler add an element then we have to create subject right for that i'm naming a subject click on identify okay i'm spying the subject subject row then click on control left mouse button and then click on highlight okay then click on apply okay then go to the blue prism software then take the right stage okay i'm um, uh, naming this as subject on okay then again you have to take the data item for writing the subject this uh, set data as text and initial value as i am giving i am typing some text and click on okay then again open the subject okay can add element then you have to create a send and click on identify okay you have to spike the send button okay using the html mode Okay, now i have spied the send button too now it is also again showing the pop up you can select the send button through the html mode for that you have to select the accessibility mode i am changing the modes i change to accessibility mode then click on the send press control left mouse button then it will show a pop up then highlight Okay, now it has it is not showing any pop up, and the send button is highlighting here. You can see. 
then click on apply okay then take the navigate button in this drag the send element then in action you have to specify the press then click on ok ok in the subject go to text and drag the subject to the value and the element ok then click on ok take the weight stages for all that I am taking the weight stages for depending on the, the internet speed we have to take the weight, st weight stages if the internet is very slow it will throw an error for that I am taking the weight stages and link to that I am linking for every stage, right stage to the weight stage. Okay, I'm dragging the right stage for clear understanding. Okay, then a link to the right stage. Then to the navigate stage. Then the end. Okay, I'm taking another weight stage here. I'm giving this one to wait, wait stages uh, depending on the internet speed for that that purpose I have given this much of uh, wait stages if your internet speed is good then you can try without giving the wait stages okay Reset it once, then click on. Okay, I'm keeping all the datums, data data items in a block for uh, in companies. If you are working, then they will keep everything in a block for clear understanding. Okay. Here I am giving the time for the wait stages. Okay, here it has shown three errors. That is why I am changing the time to six. Okay, then reset it once okay it is now it's showing zero errors then before running close your mail and also the internet explorer okay i'm clearing the history
okay then click on run okay the process has started You can see here the process is running in this small window. Okay, the mail has opened. Okay, an error is thrown. It is showing navigate stage compose on action one, unable to match any active accessibility elements. Okay. Reset it once. Okay, I'm changing the time to nine seconds depending on my internet speed. Okay, then run it once again. Okay, the process is running. You can see this in this small window. Okay, the mail has opened. Now, it has automatically opened the compose. Then it is in the wait stage. It has entered automatically the mail ID which I have given in the data item. Now it is in the wait stage. Now it has entered the subject which I have given in the data item. So you can see the mail is sending, the message has been sent, the message has been successfully sent via Blue Prism. You can see in the sent mails, here you can see, this is my friend, okay, here the subject I wrote in the data item, okay, using this process you can automate any sort of applications. Also, you can automate the SAP applications and download any files. Okay, in my next video, I'll show you how to download Excel sheets and fetch the data into Blue Prism and uh, copy into another Excel sheet. And thank you guys for watching. If you have any queries on this video, you can comment. I will reply for everyone. Also, if you have any doubts on any process, you can comment. I will just make a video on that. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.